for as long as I can at least cover these ships. Otherwise, this will never work. Where the fuck is the fire cell? Plama, you have streamed for three, six minutes now and have not eaten a, a, a single thing. I am worried about you. I'll be back to check on you, so stick around. Okay. Fire cell on pause. Okay, okay. Fuck you guys. Fire cell on pause. Let's see. Fire cell disabled briefly. We'll turn it back on. Okay. <laughs> Fire cell disabled. Fire cell disabled. Right. <clears throat> I'll turn it back on after I cover the shit. Right. Picardy. Picardy. We cannot have TTSA, that, that shit, on fire cell while, while doing this. I mean, it looks like Leon where they just made the citadel completely unhittable, honestly. Turtleback, underwater citadel. The armor isn't very impressive, honestly. You, you'll, you'll get pins on it, but you're never gonna get sits on it. You are never gonna get sits on it. You are never ever gonna get sits This is a wise that's, tactic. What is just... that? So do we have to troll what and sub messages now? Also use Twitch Prime. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. <laughs> Bro, this was a mistake. This was a mistake. Okay, that was the pick idea. It seems incredibly difficult. It seems incredibly difficult to sit that out. But, uh... What we've seen from the Sigma and the guns, the guns seem seem like absolute trash as well. Um, what else do we have? Panasia. Michelangelo. No info on it. This was the weird cruiser, right? Holy Oh, this was the This was the abomination with with the secondaries in the front and the secondaries in the back. And the main guns are the center guns. This is this is the the, the thing, the the thing. Ara, ara, my ass is blasted. The, the thing of something. Waiting for two things: for SpaceX to launch Starship and for WG to discover a proper dev team. <laughs> Keep waiting, man. I mean, the SpaceX thing is probably gonna happen, but 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 uh, the other thing, unlikely, man. All right, three torpedoes, all in the back, very exposed. I mean, on one hand, you're gonna struggle to break the turrets on this thing. Uh, on the other hand, you're not gonna need to break this the turrets is a wise on this tactic. thing because it's gonna have to give you both. Why stop there? Think. More trolling, more anti weeb wind. Okay, okay, I'm muting that. I'm muting that as well. Screw you guys. Screw you guys. You're forcing me to mute everything soon. Okay, let's see. Armor layout. Oh. Oh, that's a lot of our matchable schnoes. That is a lot of our matchable schnoes. Holy shit, 25. And 25 booty. Jesus Christ. 40, 40. 100 millimeter. It doesn't have an armor belt, so not the exposed citadel. It's not exposed <coughs> citadel. What is that? What the f is that? <laughs> you guys fuck off. Oh, look at that spaced armor. Holy shit. That might be the biggest, like, gap between broadside and actual citadel I've ever seen. Holy shit. 200 millimeters and then 60. So 260 effective armor on a cruiser? Jesus. That's a huge gap. I mean, this thing is gets so much through the nose. It's probably gonna have hidden plates in the back. That's quite big. <laughs> it is impressive. It, it is pretty impressive, man. Don't get a lot. It is pretty impressive, man. Holy shit. But yeah, holy fuck. I mean, you're gonna have to give a probably a fair bit of broadside to use these guns because they're in the center. You won't sit nose in at all. Yeah, Mr. White. Yes, How are you guys still? I think I took off the fire, sir. We have a problem. We have a problem. Guys, I turned off the fire cell. Can you guys stop being dented, please? But yeah, um, this thing looks basically a complete pain. 110 millimeters. So no rematchable deck. But I feel like the sit does come high above the waterline, so... No. no, I don't think I will. 
Uh, so I think this thing is gonna get smashed pretty damn hard if it gives, if it gives broadside. Uh, provided you don't have any sort of short fuse kind of shit, okay, or honestly at any sort of angle, I think you're gonna struggle to get the sits because your shells are gonna arm and explode before they even reach it. We'll see. We'll see. It looks looks horrendous though, like in terms of utility. But we'll see how it works. Also, it's got the shell catchers in the back. So, uh, not uh, overmatchable armor and shell catchers at the back looks like an absolute nightmare in terms of tankiness. So, yeah, we'll see. Okay, now what else do we have? An Asia? Homie, actually, Navarin first. What was Navarin? Chat, what was Navarin? Was that the. Well, that was the tier 5 BB that they basically are slapping into tier 9? Didn't it, what was it, 406mm guns? At tier 9, with 12 of them? Oh, and casemate secondaries. This thing has literally negative superstructure, by the way. Literally negative superstructure. This thing is going to be very small for a BB if you look at the size of the turrets compared to the rest of the ship. For a BB, this thing is going to be hilariously small. What kind of armor? 32. Okay, well, they didn't give it a hilarious, like, nose like some of the low-tier BBs has. So, you can farm it. You can farm this and you can farm this. Some superstructure to farm. That's good. Has a massive icebreaker, though. Fair enough. Good protection on the booty as well. 340, 75 upper, 35 millimeter deck armor. Hmm. I mean, there will be some, if it's nose in, there will be some farmable, but honestly, angled boot in, you can hope that the shell catchers will catch your shells in that case, because it might be quite frustrating. The turrets are, look, really, really strong in terms of angled, uh, angled plating. Oh boy, what the fuck is that? Okay, what the fuck is that thing? Is it, it does have a high citadel, but how much protection is around this citadel? Let's see, we got 340, 50, another 50? That's a lot of effective armor to get punched through, but it is, it is a flat sit, and it, the turtle bag doesn't extend the whole way. So, you can punch straight through here. You just need a lot of penetration. You need a lot of penetration, but uh, you will be able to punch through the entire thing as citadel. This thing will absolutely be citadel. -able. You give broadside, you will absolutely get sit in this thing. If, if you're facing a BB or like Soviet cruiser kind of, kind of penetration. And finally... Well, not finally. The m massive abomination, which is the Commissar. This ship had what? Better pinned than Moskva. And. Uh, better pinned than Moskva. Okay, it's long as hell as well. It almost looks like it's it's bent in half. I know it's an illusion because of the, the camo, but doesn't it kind of look like it's been snapped in half like this? Kind of looks like the, the hull has cracked because it's, it's an illusion because of the dazzle camo. But it looks like it's kind of like snapped in half here, and it's it's hanging on. A camo is a real mindfuck. I mean, that was the point of Dazzle Camo, to break break out, break outlines of ships and so forth. It looks like they did two, two different ships and glued them together because of this camo. It's, it's extremely disorienting. Six guns in the front, six in the back, twelve guns, and then a goddamn... Plane launching part in the back, because of course it needs to be a hybrid, because the Soviets don't have their hybrid yet, so obviously they need to have their hybrid as yet. This is going to be Soviet cruiser number 7, tier 10. Soviet tier 10 cruiser number 7. Daily reminder that the Germans have one tier 10 cruiser, the Hindenburg. And after this, the Soviets will have seven, which is more than any other nation, including nations like the USA. <laughs> so, yeah, that's that. That's certainly a choice. Okay, what are we? What, what kind of armor are we looking at here? Overmatchable snows, interesting. Or very farmable booty. 
overmatchable farmable shield catchers 30 millimeter overmatchable deck armor and upper belt and it's absolutely like it's gigantic this is a long fucking boat man this is a long goddamn boat huge exposed citadel it's exposed 150 millimeter citadel okay this thing is a fucking sailing dev strike this thing is a sailing dev strike interesting i was expecting to see some soviet armor here but no i mean the deck armor will be able to bounce the citadel deck armor not the actual deck armor you'll get pinned anyway but this is a gigantic sit this is a gigantic exposed vulnerable citadel and your average hybrid player you know he's gonna sail full broadside while sending planes so these things are probably gonna these are gonna blow up more and more than Moskva's blow up in in random battles right now these are gonna explode left right and center i don't mind i don't mind like cruisers that are vulnerable in broadside thumbs up we don't need more napoli or petro-esque cruisers in the game they're stupid and bad for the game so extremely vulnerable Dude, it looks so fucking weird with this entire booty with the planes. Can you shoot straight backwards or is like the plane hanger gonna block it? You're not gonna be able to depress your guns that much though, because this is guaranteed gonna block your arcs. I think if you're close to the ship from behind, he won't shoot, be able to shoot you at all because of the, 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 the shit blocking you. The side armor was 115, yeah. That's very vulnerable. So I see torps? Yeah, it had torps, didn't it? Oh. Well, it had torps, didn't it? They are here. Two X3s at the back. But good like good luck driving by a ship to launch these torps with this angle. Like you're gonna have to drive past he, he gets his guns on here, 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 here. He, this is where the citadel starts. All citadels. All the way over here until finally you can launch torps on him. So yeah, <laughs> good luck getting those off in a brawling situation. And that's a gigantic citadel. So what are these? These are like some copy pasta different camo ships. Oh, this was the lion, right? This was the lion with the the camo looks cool. Let's be oh, let's be honest. The camo looks wow. The effects on the camo are great. The effects on the camo are great. The level of detail on the camo is very impressive as well. It's the three kingdom ships. But ultimately, this is a lion. This is a lion. And if you're, if you're paying for a premium lion, I have a bridge to sell you because you really are dumb enough to buy that bridge. Really cool camo, but the ship is absolute junk and I can't imagine anyone actually buying it. Oh, shit. Okay, this one actually looks much better than in the pictures as well. This one looks much better live than it did in the pictures. What ship is it? This is this? Looks German. Is this like Hindenburg or something? No. Wait, what the hell ship is this? If you're in the front? It's the Eger. Eger. Yeah, I thought it was German because of the turrets. Hmm. Chinese egg. Looks pretty cool. Honestly, it looks better live than it did uh, in the screenshots. It looked it looked very little in the in the screenshots, but live it looks much much better. Still. Camos for I mean at least the camo for egg makes a bit more sense than a camo for uh lion. Okay, well done guys. You managed you managed to hold out that long. Fire sale is on again. Fire sale is active again. And uh, notifications are unmuted. There we go. There we go. And there you go. I dude, I just wanted to be able to cover, cover the ships, without you spurging all all over my. This is gonna be a long stream. This is gonna be a long stream, boys. This is gonna. 
Lord have mercy, I'm about to bust. <laughs> yeah, Are you serious? This... this is torture. You're torturing me and everyone else watching. We... Rudimentary uh, creatures of blood and flesh, you touch my mind, fumbling in ignorance, incapable of understanding. You exist because we allow it, and you will end because we demand it. Jesus Christ. Gentlemen, it is time to pasta. Oh, God. Okay. This is fine. I'm okay with the events that are unfolding currently. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit, look at that. Look uh, look at that. 2B has been added chat. Look at this. God damn. God damn. Whoa, whoa where the fuck where the fuck did it go? Oh, I lost my 2B. There we go. Look at that. 2B has I'm been stupid. added to make You're it. smart. Mm. I was wrong. You were right. God damn. You're the best. I'm the worst. God damn. God damn. God damn. Okay, we're gonna roll for that shit. I can tell you right now. We're gonna roll for that. We are gonna be rolling for that one. I can tell you right now. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, kinda deserved. But not gonna stop me. That, that bonk is not gonna stop me, man. That, that shit ain't, ain't even gonna slow me down, man. <laughs> no, 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 that no, won't stop me. No, no, that no, won't stop me. And there seems to be no sign of intelligent life anywhere. <laughs> Nobody would be crazy enough to build a boat out of glass. Ha 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 ha!